Okie dokie, guys. Welcome back to Little Nightmares. It is time for... what is this? Chapter 3? 4? I'm not sure how this game denotes its chapters. Or if that's even a thing. That looked funny. I was like slowly walking into the background there. <laughs> I don't want to keep going that way because it's probably possible to fall off. <sighs> Alright, so last time, guys, we escaped from the, the Butcher Brothers, as we call them. And I'm guessing that if it follows the same pattern, so like the first major area, we were running from Dr. Longarms, right? Just one dude. The second major area, we had the two Butcher Brothers. So I'm guessing now we're gonna enter a place where we have like three people after us. If the game just keep, you know, keeps ramping it up the same way, we're probably gonna find a place with three toilets. <laughs> That's my guess. <laughs> what the, what the fuck? Wow, okay, so we were on a ship, guys. I wasn't sure, but this looks like confirmation right here. And who are these people walking onto the ship? Dude, this is nuts. That water's pretty. Huh. They just mixed up, like, the entire aesthetic here. We're, like, outside. The nightmare is over. But it looks like we can only climb up here and we're gonna go right back inside, I guess. <laughs> This is actually a really pretty view. I like the the camera trick here where like you can see stuff going on in the background but it's out of focus so you can't really get out, you know, you can't make out any details. And also, we just seem so freaking tiny compared to the size of this thing. The ship is massive. But luckily for us, they leave tiny little ladders and holes everywhere. <laughs> little us-shaped holes to get around through. Hi, birdie. Will you fly me away to freedom? Nope. Uh, okay, I'll just go fuck myself then. And we're back inside the nightmare. Why is everybody so fat? And why are they coming onto this ship? Okay, now they're coming into focus. Some of them are wearing masks. Some of them have hats. But they're all enormously fat. That's the one thing tying everybody together. Okay, where are we going? I'm not sure I like where this is going. I gotta tell you guys, every time I see the main character in this game, I have a flashback to an angry nerd video. <laughs> you guys know the angry video game nerd, right? Of course you know him. He's, he's famous. He's awesome. But uh, one of my favorite nerd videos was his, his video on the original Ninja Turtles game on the NES. There's a part where he calls out April O'Neil because in the in the original Turtles cartoon, she always wore this like yellow jumpsuit, right? That was like her thing. She always had this yellow jumpsuit on. And there's a part in that game where she says, you have my support. And the angry nerd's like, well, what has April O'Neil ever done for you? Stupid banana raincoat wearing bitch. <laughs> and that's just such a brilliant line. It's just a little throwaway line in a really old video, but I always remember it because it was so fucking hilarious. So every time I see this girl in this game, I'm like, oh, look, another banana raincoat wearing bitch. I just thought I'd point that out. Yeah, we're definitely going back into the bowels of this place. I mean, freedom was right there. I don't know about you guys. If it was me in this little girl's position, I would have just jumped into the water and swam for it. Fuck going back inside this place. This is just the worst idea. What is going on with these people? And they're all like walking in tandem, like they're like military marching or just marching to some kind of unheard beat. Some of those masks kind of look like Guy Fox masks. There's the geisha lady. There is the geisha lady from the beginning of the game, guys. So she's like the overseer, right? She's like the head mistress of this place. I think we're gonna have to fight her. I think that's what we're coming up to here. Okay, okay. We gotta do this right. Run and jump and grab. I'm pretty sure if we fall down there, it's just all over immediately, so. Alright, so far so good. I don't think we'll be able to get up anywhere back here, but I just want to try it. Nah. Yeah, let's check the foreground, too. Nope, nothing here. Okay. Um. 
Okay, so this is what the butchers were making the food for. Whatever event is happening on this ship. Uh, yep, they're all just coming here to pig out on various kinds of things. Not the least of which is probably people meat, from what I'm gathering. Luckily, that dude seems so focused on his meat that he's not going to notice me. Okay. Okay. Oh my fucking god! He just crushed me. He just crushed me with a table, guys. <laughs> I never said a chance, man. All I did was step in there for a second and it was all over. Okay. Yeah, spot me right underneath this tub of lard right here. So, there's bottles set up right on the other side of this crack. I'm guessing there's no way to avoid alerting this guy. I'm try- Yeah, it hadn't even fallen yet. Okay. And that- I tried to move out of the way there, guys. I guess- I, I Well, first I tried to not knock the bottle over. And I guess that's just not possible. So, we're gonna move right away this time. Okay. And then just fucking run for it. I, I'm guessing we can't hide from this guy. Okay. Here we go. Okay, he's coming for us. Look at look at him crawl. Oh my god, look at him crawl. Like a fat piece of shit. Oh, this sucks. Climb! Go! Keep going. Keep going. God, where the hell do I go? Where the hell do I go, guys? Okay, I see it. We have to be quick. Careful, careful. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, we're too close to her. One more, one more good swing. Uh, uh. Fuck, this is intense, guys. There's people everywhere. There's, like, no safe zone. Somebody jizzed all over the floor right there. I just walked right through it. More floor jizz. More floor jizz. Oh, Conehead! Conehead, come here, buddy. This is not a safe place. Yo, there's a portrait of me on the wall! You guys see that right there? Is that, like, a wanted poster? What the fuck, man? Can I take it down? Can I burn it? Burn the poster. It's a bad poster. Okay. I know we're probably good at this point. I'm just gonna stay in stealth mode. Oh shit. We gotta push this thing out of the way. Okay. Conehead, where'd you go, bro? There he is. Come here, homie. Give you a hug. Make you feel all better. Light up your life. Okay, sorry. Again, immersion breaking. I just, I'm really curious about these trophies. Not all lights can be trusted, but these should be quite safe. Huh. That's not descriptive enough for me. I want to know, like, what exactly. Is it just, like, for lighting that one specifically? Or is it because I lit a certain number of them? Wait, is this a dead end in here? It kind of looks like it's... I don't know where we're going to go out here, though. Maybe we can push that pot over. I don't know why we would do that. <laughs> if we... I see. I see you guys. We're going to have to run across this table. Dodging everybody. And then climb up on the other side. I'm going to screw this up. I'm telling you guys right now, 100%, I'm going to screw this up. Run, bitch, run! Oh, God. There's so many people. There's so many people. Uh, yep. I mean, I didn't really feel like... Dude, he ate me. That guy straight up ate me. He shoved me in his mouth, like, whole. Not cool. Not cool. 
I wonder if I can just climb up from right here, from these sausage links. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Get up there. Get up there. Okay, I can't climb these, but maybe I can swing over here. No. If I can avoid running the length of the table, that's... That's the goal right there. Yes, there we go. No! Okay, one more try. One more try, guys. That one doesn't count. Neither does that one. Her momentum's acting kind of weird right now. Climb? I really can't climb up here? That makes me so mad. Why did they even put this here? Like, just to taunt you with the fact? That, like, you, you think there's gonna be a shortcut or a safer way and then it doesn't work? It's alright, we can get through this. We can get through this. See, that guy knocks me into the other guy every time. What the fuck, man? Okay. Finally made it. You better grab that shit. So these guys are pretty lazy. Like, if you're close to them, they'll grab you, but it seems like they're not going to chase me. That one guy chased me, but he was the only one. That crawling guy. <sighs> okay, super back jump! Yeah. I gotta say, up till now, guys, there was a lot more stealth in this game than I was expecting, but this level seems like it's, uh, it's throwing that out the window a little bit. <laughs> it's up in the stakes. It's up in the ante. Oh, oh, they're upset. They're all upset. Stay moving. Haha, <laughs> yeah. The chub nuts aren't following me over here sure of that. But there's more! There's more chub nuts! There's a lady chub nuts. I think that's the first lady I've, I've noticed. Oh, okay. Uh, dude! Dude, there's nowhere to go. There's nowhere to go. Okay, we're gonna have to jump over him and then run for it. I think. Gotta be careful, though. Huh! Uh, oh, he's fast. He's faster than I am. Maybe not. Oh, we're lucky he missed, man. <laughs> that was close. Okay. Hey, there's a geisha doll. Fuck me. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. It's the butcher brother. He's back. And he heard me. I don't know where I am. Guys, three toilets. Who called it? Who called that shit? <laughs> I knew it! I knew there were gonna be three toilets in this level. <laughs> well, there's four, actually. But three of them in a row there. Oh, and so it looks like somebody made a mess on the floor next to the toilets, man. I don't even want to know what that stuff is. It could be any number of bodily fluids. <sighs> okay, did he lock me in here? There was a geisha doll out there, but there was no way I had time to destroy it. Can't get out now. There's gotta be a way out of here. Can we pull the rug out? Is there a trapdoor under the rug? No. We have access to this thing. Do we throw it in the sink? I should go give that butcher brother a roll of toilet paper as a peace offering. Like, here, man, I'll even show you how to use it, because obviously you guys have issues with that. <laughs> what about this, uh, this mirror right here? 
Oh! Okay. I didn't actually expect that to work, but... Fair enough. Wait, does that mean... Does that mean it was a two-way mirror? Somebody in here is watching other people in the bathroom? I don't know why that would surprise me. Nothing about this place should surprise me anymore. Oh, dodge! Oh, yeah. That was totally my fault. I tried to hurry, and I paid the price. Okay, let's try this again, guys. What the hell is going on down there? Somebody's getting hacked up. I'm gonna fall to my death again, because this pipe is really thin. Careful, careful, careful. Okay. Ooh. I don't know where Homeboy went. But I... Oh, you know what? That's probably him in there. Okay. Um, well, let's not run so we don't draw attention. Let's just hop in the elevator. So they brought back one of the Butcher Brothers, at least. Are we going to see Dr. Longarms again? I kind of hope we do, honestly. That dude was really creepy. Although I guess he's not Dr. Longarms anymore since we chopped that shit off. <laughs> he could probably fix it somehow. That seems like the kind of thing he'd be capable of doing. Oh, fuck! Okay, yep. Wow, that's a lot of them. Why are they all here just, like, waiting for me? This is horrifying. It's a crushing wave of fat people, guys. Jesus Christ! Ah! Uh. I made it all that way and then screwed up the jump. Oh, I hate myself so much. Woo! Made it that time. One of the fatties fell to their doom, I think. Why is it a crushing wave of fat people, guys? What is this a metaphor for? Oh no. Not now. Not now. What am I gonna have to eat this time? I'm gonna have to eat a person at some point, I bet. Just like these people. I noticed that the background scenery is a picture of a wave, like an ocean wave, which is kind of what we just ran from. I wonder if that's connected somehow. Oh, what's up, little guy? It's a conehead, and he, he got a sausage for us. Thank you, homeboy. These dudes are always helping me out, man. I humbly accept your offering. What? No! No! No, stop! I'm upset. I'm upset. That's not what was supposed to happen. I didn't tell her to do that, guys. I swear. <laughs> Why did they make me do that? These guys are my friends. I'm the monster, guys. I've become what I hate most. And it doesn't even make sense because he was offering me food. Why wouldn't I just eat this thing? Is it because my character knows that it might be from another person and she'd rather eat a conehead thing? I don't know, but I don't even like myself anymore. That's fucked up, man. Wow, there's definitely a, a gradual... Uh, oh, 
wait. Oh my god, there she is, guys. There she is. I'm going back this way. Yeah, they've been upping the ante on the things that we have to eat for this entire game. If you guys think about it. At first it was just bread, and then it was, uh, like the rat, and now we're eating our friends. Our conehead friends. And I don't know why. 